Hey friends, Jason O'Dell here, luminescentphoto.com. Yes, I'm stuck at home in my living room. Uh, yesterday I posted some stuff regarding my uh, comparison of the two 50mm 1.8 Nikon lenses, the G lens as well as the S lens. And one of the things that came up was uh, this apparent focal length difference. So what we're going to learn about today is something called focus breathing. And that's where when you shift the focus of the lens, the apparent focal length changes just due to the optical design. So let's take a look at this on the back of my Z7, see what that looks like between the two lenses, okay? All right, I've put the 50 millimeter 1.8G lens on the Nikon Z7 and I'm set to manual focus mode. So what we're gonna do is I've, I'm set at more or less infinity and I'm just gonna start focusing on closer subjects. And I want you to look at the framing of this shot as it changes. As we go in and out of focus, you can see things changing along the edges of the frame. That's called focus breathing. Now let's try the same thing with the S lens. Okay, I've mounted the 51.8S onto the camera. And again, I'm gonna just change the focus. We're started here at infinity, and I want you just to look at the framing of this shot as I focus more closely. All the way to the minimum focus distance. This lens has almost no focus breathing whatsoever. The composition really doesn't change. So that tells us the difference that you were seeing in the framing of those shots that I posted in my earlier review were a direct function of focusing on a near subject and that caused the difference in apparent focal length. 